there guys, it's Dasha Bella and I am here with Sumi and today we're going to be bringing you a short quick guide on how to get up to that lighthouse because there is actually a legendary chest that you can claim up there for free. And from what I recall, the last time I opened this chest, I think I got about 50 gems, which is a lot to get for free. So let me show you how to get here and what to do to open that door because that door is actually locked. Right, we are here at the lighthouse. Now, if you don't know how to get here, it is in Agricola and it is in the very top left hand corner of this garden area. You can ride here. Um, I'm going to be honest, guys, it's so big. You should see this from like the other side of the map. Maybe that's a little bit too far. Who knows? But you should be able to see the lighthouse. So you shouldn't have any issues getting here. Now, you, when you get here, there's going to be a note. And the note says, with the lighting of the 10, the beam will shine again. And what this means is that we have to light up 10 torches, which are hidden all around Agricola to get this door open. And I'm going to back up here a little bit because as you can see, there are actually two torches. If you haven't lit them already, they should just look like giant cups. So you should be able to just walk up to them and there'll be an option to light up the torches. So make sure you light up both of these torches before we go to our next location. Now let's head on over to where the third torch is. Okay guys, so this is the third torch. It's actually up here. And the first time around, I actually didn't see this. I think this was the last torch I lit. So where this is, it's just going to be just in this little corner here, as you can see where my arrow is, you can actually just teleport to the flag near the arena and just make a hard left. Uh, and then you should see where this is, but the torch is up here. So just walk up to the column, make sure you press the light torch button, and then you should be good to go with three torches lit. Now let's look for torch number four. All right, guys, the next torch is actually off the cliff here. So once you get to this stable that's sort of on this island, jump over the railing, and then we're gonna have the torch that we can light up. The quickest way to get here actually isn't to run from the top. You can teleport down to that green checkpoint, which is in the middle of Agricola, and then just head towards this floating island. But if you wanna know where the actual thing is, it is just towards the bottom of this uh, island kind of thing. Okay guys, the next chest is actually a little hidden. So once you get to this area, um, again, if you want, you could teleport to this checkpoint. All right, you're gonna go up the staircase and we're going to stay towards the right side of the um, town because we are actually looking for this green I don't know, it's like a curtain, a curtain of green. It's actually a hidden passage to a lovely little area. And as you can see, there are two of the torches here. So we're gonna walk up to these very quietly and carefully. And we are also going to light both of these torches. And this is the location guys. So if you don't know, or you can't find that green curtain, just open up your map. You should be able to see this sort of like hidden balcony kind of thing on the right side of town. And before you go guys, just make sure you head up to the staircase on the right. There is actually a chest here. It's an epic chest. So get 20 gems, a whole bunch of money. Grab that, grab the chest guys. Next up, we're gonna head down to the dock. There's actually two torches. So the first torch down here is actually just on the way down. So we're gonna turn that on. The torch is exactly over here. I mean, you guys will see it. You, there's no way you miss this torch. So make sure you light up that torch. And then we're gonna go all the way down. And this one's gonna be a bit of an interesting torch. It's actually over there on that island. Once you're in the water with your horse, actually look for this rock here because if you follow it, there's actually a rocky path here. And you're gonna be able to jump your horse up onto this rock and then you'll be able to get this um, this torch. This torch is on that rock. I'm, I'm not on it right now, but that rock just off the edge of that cliff. I believe this is also right behind Liam's quest. Okay, guys, once you're back in town, we're actually going to go and follow the wall. 
of Agricola because there are two torches here and there should be your last two torches as well. So make sure you just follow this wall because we are going to come across two torches. This is the first one. So it's just going to be on the side. You should see it if you just follow the wall. We're going to light this torch. The location for this torch is over here. And then once you've gotten that torch, just make sure you run past the giant horse statues because we are still following the wall. And then the last torch is going to be right here on the ledge. You might miss this if you're coming from the other direction. So we're going to light the torch and then a door has opened somewhere. That's the lighthouse door opening. So if you manage to get all of the 10 uh, all of the 10 torches, then the door shall open and we'll be able to go up to the top. So the last torch is just here it's it's quite out of the way so hopefully you're going to be able to find that but let's go up to the lighthouse and claim our legendary chest and there we go the door has opened so let's head on up and grab our chest oh my gosh sumi's bridle is just like completely glitched out but yeah it's a pretty long run up the lighthouse so like don't panic if you feel like you're running forever there's a lot of spinning involved so you might get a little bit dizzy Take your time. I mean, you you get you guys have earned your chest. All right, we're almost there, and here we go. Now we just run along the edge, and here's our legendary chest. And there you have it, guys. Enjoy your legendary chest and your free gems. It was an absolute pleasure helping you find your legendary chest. But that's going to be it for Sume and me. If the video was helpful, do consider leaving a like. And if you're new to the channel, hi, my name is Dashabella. I'm a virtual equestrian VTuber and I love horse games. I try to share as many of my favorite ones on my YouTube channel and I have so many more I'd love to share in the future. So if that's something that tickles your fancy, do consider subscribing to get future notifications on all of my future uploads. That's going to be it for Sumi and me. We'll see you in our next upload. Bye everyone!